the Happy Chef Kitchen. In today's video, I'll be uh, taking a traditional crepe suzette and transforming it into a souffle suzette served with a delightful blood orange sauce. So if you like this video, please give it a like, share and subscribe to the Happy Chef YouTube channel and don't forget to hit that bell and never miss a video. But let's look at the ingredient list that we'll be using in today's video. So this is the ingredient list that we'll be using in today's recipe. So on everything on my left side here is uh, all the souffle batter or pancake batter. So that's 27 grams of self-raising flour, 24 grams of sugar. I also have 2 grams of baking powder, 15 grams of Greek style yogurt I'm using, uh, but you can use plain, just all plain uh, yogurt. I'll have uh, one tea, uh, a teaspoon of vanilla bean paste or if you don't have vanilla bean paste you can use vanilla extract. So I also have a two eggs and two egg whites separated already. Uh, you'll be using half of the, uh, the zest of this blood orange for the souffle batter, for the other half you'll be using it for the blood orange sauce. So, of course I said before the uh, zest for the orange, the rest of the orange and the juice will be going to the sauce. I have a 1 8 of a teaspoon of cinnamon powder, 34 grams of unsalted butter and 3 tablespoons or 50 grams of sugar uh, and a dash of orange liqueur to finish it off. To start off with we're going to zest our orange, uh, half of it in uh, our mixing bowl for the souffle batter and some of it into our saucepan here for the sauce. Uh, now we're going to add everything else except for the orange liqueur. So in goes the butter. The cinnamon. little bit of a little dash of nutmeg. Up. Let's get onto the stove. Now we're going to uh, bring it, uh, turn on the gas uh, to medium heat and reduce our sauce until a syrup consistency. Thank you. 
So now uh, the uh, sauce has gone up to the kind of consistency that I want it to, so we're going to turn it off and leave to one side. So now uh, we're getting onto our souffle batter. So in a uh, mixing bowl, we still have our uh, orange zest. So in goes our self-raising flour, chopstick, sugar. Powder. Just slightly like whisk it. Like so. Add our two egg yolks. A teaspoon of vanilla extract. Vanilla bean paste. But then we're going to also add our yogurt into it, just to loosen it up. This is what you should get, a plain sort of consistency, a bit of runniness, and now we're going to put this to one side and get onto our egg whites. So now we're going to start on our meringue. So we've got our egg whites into our little, another mixing bowl, and we're going to start whisking it until stiff peaks have been achieved. For our meringue has been met, so now we're going to mix this uh, into our egg yolk mixture. Just slowly add it in, but keep on mixing with a spatula. Now I'm going to transport our mixture now into a measuring cup. Make sure you get everything.
And now we're going to go over to our stove. So now uh, in a pan, uh, you need a bit of oil uh, in your pan and a bit of oil uh, for whatever shape you're using. So for me, I'm using a, a small three centimeter ring. I'll link that to uh, this product uh, in the description below. But you're gonna oil this and the pan so it doesn't prevent it from sticking. Now I'm going to turn on the heat. I'm going to put this on. Well, medium heat. And then once we've added the uh, uh, souffle mix, which, uh, a side note, make sure once you use up the this, uh, when you make this batter, make sure you use it immediately so it doesn't deflate because of the egg whites or just the and now uh, my pan's hot enough uh, I'm going to turn down uh, my stove all the way down to the lowest setting and uh, we're going to pour it in our souffle batter cook it for two minutes on each side so now it's been two minutes I'm going to now flip it over carefully and now let so now I'm going to so now I'm going to carefully take this out and Carefully go around the ring. to now place it into our sauce next. Now I've just reheated the Suzette so I'm going to just uh, place it my uh, souffle in and just basing it on all the sides carefully placing it Now all that is to do is to plate it up. So now as you saw in the previous uh, shot, uh, I've added the orange, uh, blood orange sauce and I added a bit of orange liqueur and then flambéed it. So there you have it, my souffle Suzette. So, so if you like this video, you know what to do. Like, share and subscribe to the Happy Chef YouTube channel. Remember to uh, hit that bell to get notified when my next videos come out. So from me, stay safe. Enjoy cooking.